have, uh, as I've prepared for concerts with this uh, wonderful community band, let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> Such a great, great group to be in front of. Um, I've enjoyed uh, looking at John Philip Sousa marches and going through the Marine Band catalog of all the different marches that they put on their website for free. And it's just fun to look at all the different things, some things that I haven't played before, haven't conducted before. Uh, so it's always interesting to look through that website. And uh, this year I happened to come across one that was actually the winner of uh, March Mania, which the Marine Band uh, sponsors on their website where you can listen to two marches in a day and vote for your favorite one and go through the whole thing uh, just like March Madness only with marches. Um, and this year's winner happens to be the march that we chose to play tonight. Uh, it's a little bit of a different march uh, for a John Philip Sousa march. Um, the date of this march has inscribed on the manuscript of the piano arrangement by C.H. Uh, Hattersley is 1876. The manuscript is not at the U.S. Marine Corps Museum. Um, the occasion of the march's composition is not known. When President U.S. Grant died in 1885, Sousa arranged the piece for band, apparently at the publisher's request. It has rarely been performed, but was fittingly used at the U.S. Marine Band, uh, by the U.S. Marine Band in Sousa's funeral procession. This is John Philip Sousa's The Honored Dead.